out of the way. 31. Uh, 33. 33. Problem 33 has a little bit of a trick. <coughs> How do you show an irrational multiple of pi? This is the first one when I realized they have this. You should have told me before. <laughs> and I was like, keep jumping. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you haven't realized it? No. no. All of our So you. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. So, problem 33. So like I said, we're going to use problem 31. Oh, five, sorry. Problem 31, which is not on the board. It is on the board. Actually, yes. Oops. I was the one who thought it was not on the board. Actually, it is on the board. No, problem five. So what do we know? So I have this triangle. of integer coordinates and also f as an integer coordinate. So there are points on the lattice. And I know that one of these angles is less than 30 degrees. Less than five or six. So let me write like this. Now, if So, what do we know about the distances between these guys? They're all vertical. Yeah. They're, they're, they're what? On the range. Something like this, yes. So, what do I want? It's. Um, they're rational numbers, right? You get cosine 2 and cosine yeah. 3. You use the cosine. Cosine twice the So, it's double and double. So you say cosine, or, and now I say cotangent, <coughs> anyway, whatever. So one of the angles is like we did, so why is there to go there like this? So um, <coughs> the problem is when is the cotangent? So suppose that, okay, so what do I need to prove? I need to prove that at least one of them cannot be a rational multiple of pi. Suppose all of them are a rational multiple of pi, right? So suppose uh, so this is, a, let's say, Q1, right? Pi.
if I take a, the cotangent of it, right? So cotangent. So the thing is that I want to use here is when is the cotangent to the left? And this goes back to algebraic integers. When is the cotangent of a, let's say, rational q pi is 1 when q is in q? When is this rational? If and only if. Does it become obvious? Yeah. Yeah. Why it's obvious though? Because I mean, not the proof of the lemma, the problem. Why not take us less than 30 degrees? Yes, this is not because you're taking the negative token of the angle in between two lines with rational slopes, hence they have rational cotangents, and the angle between them has a rational cotangent. So it has to be at least 45 degrees. Simple. 